Yes, ma'am. That's my specialty, IBM Selectric. What do you got, a Selectric 2, 3? 102 years old. Well, that's close to my age. My real name is Steve, S-T-E-V-E, -E. last name is K-A-Z-M-I-E-R-S-K-I, -E but I don't use the S-K-I at the end on my business cards. We're on Montrose Avenue, 1623 West Montrose Avenue. I've been here for nine years now. It's, it's called Independent Business Machines. We repair typewriters, all makes and models and we sell ribbons, because nobody sells ribbons anymore. That just happened. I didn't choose this to be my bread and butter. When I was about 16, I, this company, one particular company, they hired me. They never asked me how old I was, and uh, I started working on typewriters. After a while, I said, ah, that's not for me. It's not, a, you know, I already got to know a little bit, you know, uh, the typewriters. So I said, I'm going to go look for, for a different job. I went to Western Electric Company, and uh, I put down an application, what I did. Oh, we need a typewriter man. I said, I'm not a typewriter man. I was only taking them apart and putting them together. Well, you know more about them than we do. <laughs> and that's it. The, the rest is history. And now people need me more than ever. There's no typewriter places anymore. This one works. Beautiful. I restore old machines, a hundred years old or even older. No one knows how to work on those machines. Now, this one, for example, this is from 1930s right here. I got some here over a hundred years old. And they come out like brand new. They really represent something. Not like today's typewriter that's made in China, all plastic. This one is close to 100 years old. This is what it looks like, rusty. The only problems we're having is getting uh, the decals. Everything else can be done. Then it's this one. This one is the same, same model. It's a number five underwood. It's already been done, and it takes about 15 hours to do one. And it's beautiful. They represent the old era, you know, how people uh, made their living those days, like the horse and the buggy. I would prefer that over the automobiles. And a lot of people prefer typewriters. There's so many people. There's a diversity in this city, and this is one of those quote, fines, unquote, that really make uh, the city exceptional. And uh, I know Steve is here, I know he does good work, and uh, although I have a computer, I prefer writing personal letters, uh, envelopes, on my typewriter. It's just the way I like to do it. It's a great satisfaction when you take a machine that's completely silent, it's been for 50, 60 years. Nothing moves on it. You put it back to life like Dr. Frankenstein. I'm going to try to keep on going. As long as St. Peter's not going to touch me, you know, then I'm going to keep on going. You know, if he gives me health, and so, <laughs> then I'm going to keep on going. Besides, my wife likes for me to work. <laughs>